Yo, what's going on guys? It's Vidic here and welcome back to Anarchy Scape. Anarchy has just added in a new best in slot range weapon that you can actually grind at any level, the Ray Gun. Pew, pew. Well, uh, uh, I mean. The Ray Gun is super strong and the best part is there are no requirements to get it yourself. Anybody can do it regardless of their level. If you haven't tried Anarchy yet, now is the perfect time because every single day you can do 50 NPC kills on any NPC in the game and get 50 weapon boxes. These are the boxes that you open to get the Ray Gun and once you get it, it never runs out, never disappears, you have it forever. Now before we get into the video, we're actually going to be giving away 500 of these weapon boxes as a giveaway. I'll also be opening a bunch later if you're curious about the rewards, but if you want to get some free boxes, first place and second place both get 250. All you gotta do to enter is like the video and put your Anarchy Scape in-game name down below. And don't forget about this golden chest at home, you can get some really OP free stuff by coming here and typing Vidic 2021. Not only will you get the super powerful Noctis Sword lent for 24 hours, You'll get a scroll box with even more stuff, and you'll have a chance of getting the best in slot pet, the immortal demon that actually has a 100% drop rate increase. If you go down here to your notice board and click on achievements, you'll see that Anarchy has now added in daily and weekly tasks. These are actually how you get the mystery boxes. Like I said, 50 NPC kills, that's it, and you get 50 weapon boxes every single day. Not only that, but it can be on any monster, even the easiest monsters in the game. I came over here to ghouls because they're, they're kind of like zombies, but there's a lot more of them here for me to kill. 50 HP, so even if I was just starting off my account, we'd have no problem killing 50 of these. That's 50 kills and 50 weapon boxes promptly deposited into my inventory. Now, I'll open more of these later, but uh, you know, hey, can we, can we get it? Can we get on our first 50? It's a little bit rarer than that. Oh, I got something special. I don't even know what it was. I clicked too fast. Oh, Obsidian Scythe. Look at that. That's actually a really good weapon. So if we just started our account, killed 50 goblins, got a fucking Obsidian Scythe just like that. That is massive. I really like how they do this. Even if you don't have a lot of time to play every day, you can still kill 50 easy NPCs, join in on the fun and get some OP items. All right. How about a couple more? We opened 50 so far. No ray gun. Oh, oh my God. I think we just got an obsidian scythe and a twisted bow, like almost back to back. Another scythe? Wow, okay, the drop rate on these like semi rare items is insane. It seems like I'm getting one like every 15 boxes. Oh, we got it. What is that? How many did we open? Barely any. We opened like 170. And as you can see, there it is the ray gun from a weapon box. So that's actually not bad at all. Maybe we just got super lucky to get it in under 200 boxes, but at the same time, like, look at all of the other rares that we were getting while we were opening this. By the way, every now and then you're going to see that there is a party that'll be announced in the chat and spam so you don't miss it. All you do is type colon colon party and they'll be dropping a bunch of free stuff here in this box. You can even get donator dollars from this. They do a bunch of these drop parties and I also recommend checking out the Anarchy Discord because they have events going on every single day for free stuff. All right, let's test this bad boy out. I got a nice OP ranging setup so we can see its full potential. It even has a spec, which I don't know what it does yet, how strong it is. We'll find out. And we're going to be testing it out at medium raids, which actually got a revamp. And not only that, but if you noticed earlier in the daily tasks, there is an achievement every single day to open 25 rage chests. So we're going to go to mini games, page two and raids two. And you're going to see right here that there are actually new modifiers for every single raid you can go up to hard for a four percent drop rate boost and i think we'll do that let's let's see what we can do it might be a little tough to be honest oh geez okay let's just let's just rip off a spec right now fuck it 585 not 650 656 656 the hell are they like a double hit okay cerberus you got a lot of hp my friend god damn Maybe we should try to kill Noctis for first. Chill. Chill, 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 chill. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, this is this is actually a lot harder than I thought. Oh my god, he just does not stop digging. Look at him. Look at him. Right into the fucking ground. Oh god, the best best possible time. Best possible time to get an instant kill. 
And wow, look at that, 18 Fury Sharks. I'm guessing with the harder modifiers, we get more of these. You definitely want to pick these up. They're just stackable food. I don't know why Cerberus is so confused and not attacking me, but I'm totally cool with it. Oh, I just realized, oh my God. The Ray Guns, oh, okay. The Ray Gun spec is insane. I didn't even notice it before, but it only uses 15% spec. So, for example, Primal Warrior can be a bit annoying and fuck us up. We can just spam this. Oh my god, okay. Okay, that changes everything. Yeah, that's crazy. So, the max hit I've seen pretty high, 650, getting close to 700. But what's really nice about it is how fast it attacks. I feel like it's a tick or two faster than the older best in slot range weapons, which makes all of the difference, as you know. All right, so our current chance of reward is 49%. In order to actually open the chest, you do need to wait until it's 50%. Now, usually when you're making money off raids, you want to wait until it's a little bit higher. That way you're guaranteed reward. It's really good money making. But since we're trying to open up 25 of these in a day, we might as well open it every single chance we can. Oh my God. Okay. Uh, that's really good. That's really good. That is crazy that we got those on the very first try. These are actually the legs I have on anyways, which are super strong. Now I'm going to show you guys the fastest way to grind out these raid chests so you can do it as quick as possible and get your reward. But um, I also wanted to show you guys that they upgraded the Thor's Warhammer. This weapon was already super OP and now they gave it a 50% buff. It is currently the best in slot magic weapon, but it does come with a bit of a price, a bit of a challenge. It's a little tough to get. If you go to your notice board, you click on achievements, you go to city diaries and on the third page is the diary for Thor's Warhammer. Now, I've been given this one to test out. I have not completed the diary yet, but as you can see, it's a bit tough. Some of these will get over time, like killing a lot of monsters, but other ones you are going to have to grind out a bit, like completing laps in the barbarian course, killing specific monsters, etc, etc. But it is all worth it because this weapon is just insanely OP. All right, so what we want to do is get as many rage chest opens as possible, as quick as possible. We don't necessarily care about the loot from the rage chest themselves. We'll probably still get some stuff. But the idea is to speed run this daily task. So we're going to do easy raids on easy mode. Nothing crazy. I recommend easy raids because you can almost completely AFK this and just check back whenever you have a 50% chance of a reward, which is the minimum you need to open the chest. All the monsters are aggressive and there is only one Simon that you got to be careful about. He can kill you when you're AFK if he gives you, you know, like a, a move command or something and you don't move. But if you die, you only lose 25% of your points. You respawn here and you'll continue to auto retaliate on the monsters. Also, Thor's Warhammer is absolutely insane. I'll show you guys right now. I, I've seen the max hit so far at 1849, over 1800. Let's see if we can hit it again here. I mean, I think with the buff, this might just be the best weapon in the entire game now. So we'll just kill Blink here. Then we can open up the chest. Don't really worry too much about the reward. We are doing easy raids and then we can continue back up here in AFK. And there it was our max hit 1,849. My God. But alrighty, guys, that's going to do it for our video today on Anarchy Scape. Remember, you can log in every single day, kill 50 of any monster in the game, get 50 weapon boxes and get yourself this OP ray gun. I got it on like one box 180, which is really not bad at all. Maybe I just got a little bit lucky, but I don't think drop rate affects mystery boxes anyways. So you guys might get it even quicker than I did. Either way, though, please like the video if you did enjoy. Subscribe to my channel if you want me to upload more videos. And have a nice day.